Listen, I have nothing but great respect for uh, women on this committee who have proposed uh, legislation and deeply concerned just listening to what you have to say about the sanctity of life. I don't know anyone on this committee that isn't and doesn't care deeply about that. But when you see, as Mr. Doggett pointed out, people in Texas fleeing for their lives, women in Tennessee concerned about their lives, that's the sanctity of life as well. And it's a subject matter area that tugs at everybody's heartstrings. But at the end of the day, is it a governmental decision? Or is that a decision between the individual, their doctor, and their conscience? Government can do an awful lot of things, but when it comes in a very constructive way, but when we see the adverse effects and the jeopardy that that places so many women in, it's unfair. It's not right. Uh, and that's why I join with my colleagues in uh, opposing uh, this uh, legislation. Uh, and I say that with great respect for the individuals who have I know I'm putting forward this legislation, care deeply about the sanctity of life, as do I. But that goes both ways, and especially as it relates to women who have less means, women who are impoverished, women who don't have the opportunities that many of us do. Uh, and with that, uh, Mr. Chairman, I'll yield back uh, my time.